please. Please, let's not leave like this, okay? Talk to me. What's there to talk about? I wanted to sleep with you when you didn't work. That is not true, and you know it. Priya, just listen to me, okay? I wanted to make love to you so badly it hurt. But I didn't, because I knew you'd hate it afterwards. The Priya I used to know is, is light years away from the woman I'm seeing right in front of me. You don't have to make love to me just for the hell of it. But sex is supposed to be an expression of love. It is not the only expression of love. And it's even more inappropriate when you're married to someone else. Actually, the thing is, uh, I'm, I'm actually waiting for someone and... Uh, Where are you off to? Uh, what? No, actually. Unless, of course, you want to go out for a drink or two. <laughs> I wish I could, but I'm going somewhere with Elvis later in the day, so I gotta run now. So? So, maybe some other time. Listen, um, I know of this very cool joint somewhere on the island. You know, could go out sometime. When? Friday? 6 p.m.? I could work. Okay, yeah. Just give me a call. I'll be waiting for yeah. you. Yeah. Oh, Tina. Tina, I'm actually sorry. 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 So, that's him? He doesn't really look like a gangster. What does a gangster look like? Come on, not like this. This one is a hot bloke. Hello, Ziggy. I'm waiting for your answer. Contest is not over yet. I think we should consider other options. I need you break easily. You have always been so soft. This was your idea, remember? Hunting down your old love. Maybe it was never about what we needed after all. But what you've been needing ever since your husband died. Right now, I am past the point of caring what your reasons were or what you have to do. Ziggy's answer had better be yes. Or there will be blood. I did my best. That doesn't answer my question. Hope he wakes up willing to go tomorrow. He's being stubborn, isn't he? Somewhat reluctant. We might have to take him out. You think he'll betray us? Possibly. I'm sure he won't. We can't take chances. I know he won't. What makes you so sure? I know what he's capable of. People aren't what do you think they are sometimes. I know this one, trust me. Are you sending a message across? Hold me responsible for any default. Chidi. I hope you know what you're doing. It's been the greatest honor if you would agree to be the mother of my children. Look, I don't have silver or gold, but I will give you my heart, my body and my soul. For as long as I live, till death do us part. So, I am asking you, right here, right now, Abby, will you marry me? I saw you. I saw you with a man kissing and romancing on the streets. On the streets, Joyce! <laughs> Have you no self-dignity? No self-respect? What's the problem with you? Sister, I see you've found your fan.
Ziggy and I need to have a talk. Go back to the hotel. <laughs> and you? I just want to know if it's okay for me to check up on you when I get back. Yeah. You are getting married. So, looking at it from all angles, it seemed like the best decision to make was to relocate. And now? It's not cast in stone yet, but with my complete acquisition of the television station, I should be around a lot more now. Interesting photographs take getting used to. I'm not used to seeing the world in black and white. I am. It's as simple as right or wrong. So, are you going to do it? Move my merchandise? Oh, so that's why you brought Yasmin here, isn't it? To convince me. You always had a soft spot for her. I thought you never liked to see the side of us together. <laughs> you must be very desperate. Not really. After all, she broke up with you, remember? Hmm. I suppose with a little persuasion from you. Well, you can't blame a brother for looking up for his sister. I always wanted Yasmin to be safe and happy. You getting caught smuggling only hardened my resolve to keep her away from you. I could easily have let you rot in jail. Or better still, be killed. Then why didn't you? Yasmin begged for your life. And agree to marry whosoever I chose for her if I promise to bust you out of jail. End of story. You are not doing a very good job of endowing me to your cause. Nevertheless, you owe me. I think we're even. <laughs> <laughs> Seriously. Are you going to do it? Are you going to run my guns for me? My answer is still the same. No. Such ingratitude after saving your life. You would have let me rot there if not for Yasmin's intervention. True. But a death is still a death. Don't test my patience, Ziggy. I thought you cared about me. I do. And that is why I stopped myself. 